Elon Musk's companies, notably SpaceX, have forged significant ties with the U.S. military in recent years. SpaceX's innovative technologies have positioned it as a key player in launching military and national security payloads into space. Get ready for an adrenaline-fueled journey into the future of aerospace innovation as Elon Musk unveils an extraordinary hypersonic aircraft that promises to outperform even the most advanced U.S. fighter jets. How could this groundbreaking technology redefine the boundaries of speed and capability in aviation? Can Musk's creation truly surpass the prowess of the current military? Welcome back to another exciting video. Today's video is about Elon Musk revealed insane new hypersonic aircraft better than U.S. fighter jets. Before we start the video, please like, subscribe, and press the bell icon. Anything Mach 5 or above is considered hypersonic, roughly equivalent to 3 800 miles per hour. On November 16, 2004, NASA's experimental space plane, the X-43A, achieved a groundbreaking milestone by establishing a new speed record for jet-powered aircraft. During an uncrewed test flight, the plane soared to Mach 10, an astonishing 10 times the speed of sound, equating to approximately 6 600 miles 10, 600 kilometers per hour. This remarkable accomplishment surpassed its previous record of Mach 7, which was set in March 2004 during an earlier test flight. Unlike rocket-powered aircraft, the X-43A scramjet engine scoops up oxygen from the atmosphere, reducing the need for onboard oxygen and cutting down the spacecraft's weight. This innovation holds the potential for more cost-effective Earth-to-orbit space travel. While the thrill of traveling faster than sound is captivating, hypersonic aircraft are yet to transport cargo or passengers. However, they have sparked an arms race, particularly in hypersonic missiles. These missiles, which can operate at lower altitudes and exhibit high maneuverability, present challenges for anti-ballistic missile defenses. Two primary types of hypersonic weapons are hypersonic glide vehicles, HGV, and hypersonic cruise missiles, HCM. HGVs glide toward their targets after an initial rocket launch, while HCMs are powered throughout their flight path by air-breathing engines. Noteworthy tests include DARPA's Falcon Hypersonic Technology Vehicle 2, HTV-2, reaching 2010 but falling short of its planned 30-minute route. In February 2023, the U.S. Army successfully tested its long-range hypersonic weapon, LHW, utilizing glide technology. The race for advancements in hypersonic capabilities continues to unfold, reshaping the landscape of military technology. Elon Musk's collaboration with the U.S. military has proven exceptionally valuable. A technology transfer mechanism known as a CRADA, Cooperative Research and Development Agreement, was established to facilitate this partnership. Notably, the Pentagon is exploring the adaptation of Musk's Starship Super Heavy to align with its requirements. Previously, Musk's company invested $149 million to construct satellites for tracking missile launches, a significant asset shared with partners, including Ukraine. Recent military orders include a SpaceX space shuttle and a launch vehicle capable of transporting 80 tons of payload worldwide in just 60 minutes, four times faster than the Boeing C-17 Globemaster. The focus now shifts to developing a hypersonic aircraft, which is crucial in potential confrontations with nations like Russia. While the U.S. Air Force historically prioritized stealth over speed, high-speed aircraft prove indispensable for specific combat missions. Elon Musk's innovative contributions and hands-on involvement promise accelerated progress in this ambitious project. The Pentagon currently entertains two primary initiatives, a sixth-generation fighter under the NGAT program for the U.S., Navy, and Air Force, and Lockheed Martin's SR-72 project, known colloquially as the Son of Blackbird. While God's advancements have been well documented, the SR-72 project has operated under secrecy since its classification as top secret in 2018, funded from a confidential budget. Fun fact. In the iconic movie Top Gun Maverick, the SR-72 Dark Star made a memorable appearance. Surprisingly, no concrete evidence of such a jet's existence exists. 
However, intriguing hints suggest the possibility of a successor to the legendary SR-71 is already soaring through the skies, or, at the very least, in the exciting planning stages. Elon Musk's involvement in the SR-72 program denotes a significant stride forward. This Lockheed SR-71 Blackbird successor focuses on strategic reconnaissance, expanding its capabilities beyond its predecessor. Its envisioned combat mission involves breaching enemy air defenses with hypersonic speed, capturing high-resolution images, identifying hostile air defense points before swift return to safety. Further tactical strategies include neutralizing detected air defense points and deploying bombers and attack aircraft to dismantle enemy infrastructure. The SR-72 strike capabilities, initially intended for precision strikes rather than large-scale offensives, represent a critical aspect of its development. To neutralize the command posts within terrorists' bunkers, hypersonic aircraft present a significant advantage as they can effectively substitute for the initial booster stage in a hypersonic missile. In the ongoing conflict against Ukraine, the Russian aerospace forces have already implemented their air launch strategy. Employing the MiG-31K fighter as a carrier for a singular dagger missile, the dagger successfully targeted subterranean ammunition depots in Ukraine, demonstrating their unparalleled capability among non-nuclear munitions to accomplish such precise and impactful tasks. Leveraging high kinetic energy, fortifications cause an internal explosion upon penetrating a fortified structure. This explosion triggers the detonation of stored ammunition, rendering the warehouse unusable. The SR-72 project holds considerable significance in the current geopolitical landscape. American aircraft also play a crucial role as carriers for the inaugural U.S. Hypersonic missiles, with recent successful tests conducted as part of the nation's ongoing hypersonic weapons development. Trials of prototype hypersonic rocket components took place at NASA's Wallops Island Spaceport in Virginia. Nevertheless, the primary obstacle facing the Son of Blackbird project lies in the need for a suitable power plant. The challenge arises from the shared dilemma between hypersonic aircraft and missiles regarding flight dynamics, encompassing subsonic, supersonic, and hypersonic ranges. While rockets follow a linear trajectory, allowing for sequential engine acceleration, hypersonic aircraft necessitate a more intricate solution. The Russian Aerospace Forces employ an acceleration mechanism attached to the base of a supersonic aircraft. However, a hypersonic aircraft requires the ability to take off and land and maneuver, change altitude, and alter its flight direction. Thanks for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, please like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more exciting content.